All right, so this is a brand size structure again, and uh, that mid brand ponds and below is a medulla blanc gutter. So we went over every deep structure on the mid brand. On the outer surface, enter and lateral surface of the mid brand, we see out the vertical fibers. Those represent for the uh, cerebral peduncles, and they allow the lower and upper brand communicate to each other. Okay, and obviously. That right there is your memory body. Okay. So go back here to this model. Below the midbrain is the pons. The pons are both chief uh, structure that extend forward, the round ball. And the fun primary function for the pond is the respiratory center. And it's allowed the cerebellum, lower brain, and upper brain to communicate. You can see it is run the three way intersection. Um, behind the pond is your cerebellum, which is a movement coordination center for the muscle. And in between the pons and the cerebellum, we have a space called fourth ventricle. And the third ventricle communicates with the fourth ventricle through a cerebral aqueduct. Okay? Alright, um, move along. Down below, we got the medulla oblongata. Come back here to this model. As you can see, this below here is medulla oblongata, and the front, this, this track on both sides right here is a medulla pyramid. They allow the spinal cord to communicate with the brain upper. And in between your hypoglossal nerve and the vagus nerve, we have the little round bochy thing, which is the olive. And the olive is the one that makes sure that the lower part of the, brain, of the spinal cord we communicate with the cerebellum. Okay, so it re relates the station from all over the parts of the brain to the cerebellum. Okay. Inferior to the cerebrum. And on the outside surface, we have the ridges or the folds. Those are called folia. And the folia are comparable to the gyrus of the cere cerebrum. Okay. Right here, you can see that the ridge that divides the right and left hemisphere is the vermis. It's allowed the right and left hemisphere of the cerebellum to communicate. When you chop the cerebellum in half, then you see those white fibers, the white branches. Those are called the arborvitae, and it's the white matter of the cerebellum. 